Hello friends and welcome back. Welcome to Venice Sports Shack and welcome back to a special pop-up episode. Today it's a very serious situation and I'm coming straight to you to let you know what's going on. So as always stand up, stretch out, because away we go. Alright guys, I don't know how long this video is going to be but it's serious. Um, Someone out there continually calls, 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 calls. Someone has a private number. Let me jump behind the camera. Private number, private number, private number, private number, private number. Since yesterday, I've been called 21 times by the same gentleman. He's leaving voice messages. I answered once and I told him to stop calling. I told him I'm a grown man. He made threats of violence, said if I put my hands on him, he, I would know what was going to go on. And I told him, no, sir. I'm a 55-year-old man. I don't fight. I'm in fear for my life. I do have a concealed carry permit that does transfer state to state. And I will defend myself. I have started the process of defending myself. I called the Angola City to Police Department. Report number 24-2641. As you can see, I called the Angola City to Police Department at 227 today. You can call and check and see if that's not. Check online. And while I was talking to them, I got two calls from the private number. So the report was filed. And if you continue the call, they will track the number. You can check this online, but private numbers can be tracked once I get the incident number from the police by uh, my carrier. AT&T will provide me the gentleman's number if he continues. Or he threatened me to take me down at the National and to attack me there in front of everybody and see what I was going to do then once he confronted me. Guys, I have no idea who this person is. I am going to let you listen to the voicemails, though, I think. Um, maybe by the voice, some of you have heard this voice. Um, so let me jump behind there. Listen, press 1, send. First saved message. Okay, little End of message. Delete. Press 7. Save. Press 9. Resave. Fucking loser. Fucking don't be stupid. Or you fucking stupid ass fucking YouTube. You're fucking out of your fucking mind. You fucking stupid the shit you say, dude. 90% of the shit you say is fucking bullshit. Keep it up. Don't be stupid. End of message. Delete. Press 7. Resave. This is what your contact sounds like, Paul. End of message. Delete. Press 7. Save. Press 9. More option. Resave. Reality. <laughs> you been fucking it has the floor three times dude because you're a fucking loser bro look at you dude you're out of your fucking mind dude you're fucking crazy dude jump in the collusion thinking you know who this is you don't yeah you're like collect blue goods i don't collect that fucking joke you fucking loser so you have no fucking clue, Paul. And when I see you in fucking person, I'll let you know who this is and see what the fuck you do about it because you won't do shit, you fucking old man. Go fuck yourself. End of mess. Resave. Okay, guys. That's what I'm dealing with. So again, I have a conceal carry permit. I've been threatened. I will defend myself and I will stand my ground. He threatened to see me at the National. Check the stand your ground laws in Ohio, guys. I'm telling this specifically to the gentleman calling me. I can protect myself, anyone with me, or anyone without retreat. Without retreat if you come up and attack me. 
If you come up and don't get away from me. I wanted to pull up the video. Sir, this is going to be the last few times you call me, you fucking psycho. I don't know what to do, guys. So, anyhow, I will defend myself. Um, there was recently a case where... YouTube harasser shot YouTube harasser shot Here we go guys I try to explain to you people Bring your trip to life with and this is just a fair warning integration. to please leave me alone Shocking, never-before-seen video that led to the shooting of a notorious YouTube prankster. You can see the prankster. He's the six foot Man five found dude not in the guilty for shooting cat. YouTube. His target is a guy prankster. named Alan Coley, and he's holding Don't a bag Don't come up and harass me. I wanted to show you that, guys. I'm not making any threats. Any threats whatsoever. But I don't know who this guy is. No, absolutely. No idea. These are the guys you influence. These psychos. You guys out there telling people to invest in cards. You guys out there telling people that these are investments and uh, to clean your cards and a bunch of psychos. You guys don't get it. You're influencing the lowest of the lowest. 80% of the people in this hobby are less average than you. I keep telling you that. You guys don't go to shows. You sit on Com C. You joke. You laugh to one another. Uh, you, you don't go to shows, not to real shows. Then you act like you know everything, and then you tell these people this. And they lose their fucking mind when they find out they're wrong. And then they blame people like me for telling the truth. So, I'm here to fight the good fight. Let's hope we win. But always, guys. Whew. See if I can find something to dance to. Not really in the mood. As always, guys, comment down below. Tell me what you think. Peace. Have a super great day. Why'd we really come here? Keep dancing.